Well, he's sold 65 million records in a career spanning 50 years. And Michael Bolton... Oh, Miley, this is very exciting. So the mullet was out. Yeah. Love is in for Michael Bolton. Yeah, how wonderful. He has found love again. Michael Bolton has been inspiring romance through his music for years. Now Cupid's Arrow has struck the superstar. The power ballad. There's the voice, the looks and, of course, the hair. Do you miss the luscious locks? I really don't. <laughs> I don't miss the amount of time it takes to wash them. No, I knew I made the right decision maybe 10 minutes after I had it cut. People still are talking about it, you know, still talking about it as if it's a thing, you know. It is a thing. Yeah. Michael Bolton's hair is a thing. Why did you cut your hair? <laughs> what is wrong with you? It still looks fabulous as it is. Oh, thank you. <laughs> Mission accomplished. The hair might be shorter, but Michael Bolton is still every inch an icon and having more fun than ever. Unafraid to take the mickey and recently unmasked on The Masked Singer as the wolf. Is the wolf your animal of choice? No. <laughs> What's I was not sending, a, not sending a message, a personal <laughs> message. Do you have an animal of choice? That's a tough question. Because <laughs> a dog is man's best friend. True. That's because they don't judge as harshly. So the judges at one point thought that you might have been Justin Timberlake or Richard Marks. Compliment? <laughs> Compliment, uh, yes, but how could you not hear the difference? <laughs> <laughs> the timbre of the voices. I completely agree with you. Now, Michael is back with his first album of all original songs in 14 years. He began writing Spark of Light during the pandemic, saying he felt a responsibility to help people find a spark in their lives. This album is so upbeat and has quite a positive energy. So you started smiling while you started talking about the album, so that's good. <laughs> well, I enjoyed it. Thank you. We're gonna make this a beautiful world, a beautiful world. Oh, oh, oh. We're gonna make this a beautiful world. Like his greatest hits, Spark of Light is full of romance. Over the years, Michael's high profile relationships have included Nicolette Sheridan, Terry Hatcher, and Brooke Shields. Now, at 70, this long time bachelor father and grandfather has found love again. It did sound like I was listening to the soundtrack of a great romance. Is there anything or anyone that has inspired any of those songs on there? Is there? <laughs> I have a girlfriend. You do? I do. Oh, congratulations. I'm happy for you. Thank you. Did she inspire any of the music on that album? Directly or indirectly, yes. Well, I'm happy to hear that. I hope that you two are very happy together. Thank you very much. I need to call my publicist. <laughs> Here's what I can tell you about Michael's partner. Her name is Heather Kersner. She's a 54-year-old socialite. They've actually been friends for 15 years but only became romantically involved last year. Michael's new album, Spark of Light, is out now, guys. Great interview. They look very happy together too in yeah, those photos. let's hope so. Mm. Thank you, Miley.